Kettleman City is getting a new neighbor, a facility which turns human waste into a type of fertilizer. It's being built east of town. Action News reporter Gene Hagenson tells us where it will be used and when the sludge will be arriving. This cropland near Kettleman City may soon be producing crops with the help of what's being flushed down millions of Los Angeles toilets. The sanitation districts of Los Angeles County are building this massive facility. The plan is to truck treated human waste in from L.A., bring it here, mix it with plant material and wood chips, compost it, then spread it on up to 30,000 acres of farmland. Kings County officials are convinced it'll be safe. The public uh, health and safety of Kettleman City residents has been a priority since day one. I got to understand that the Kings County ordinance protects uh, environment, water quality, and public health. Kings County signed off on the plan several years ago with assurances from the state that treated waste would be safe. L.A. County Sanitation Managing Engineer Ajay Malik tells Action News there's nothing to worry about. There's uh, strict regulation in terms of uh, certain toxic compounds that cannot be, you cannot exceed certain levels of toxic compounds, and uh, we certainly are, you know, will be well below all of those regulatory standards. But using treated sewage on crops is controversial. Merced County stopped allowing Bay Area waste from being used on crops 20 years ago. Kern County is now in a court battle to put a stop to human waste being spread on its land from L.A. This facility is a Kings County facility. It's under Kings County laws, regulations, and ordinances, and it will be operated in accordance with all Kings County laws, regulations, and ordinances. The debate over the stuff being used in Kings County appears to have stopped. Westlake Farms plans to use the compost, but only on non-food crops like cotton. The first shipment is expected to arrive in October. Near Kettleman City, Gene Hagenson, ABC 30 Action.